what up losers today? School, it's a Monday, worst day of the week. Bunch of lames at this school, man. I mean, nothing really ever. What is that? Oh my God, oh my God, Samantha, Samantha. Oh no, it's all Peanut butter. Look at her leg. Is that peanut butter? Oh, no. All over her. No, do not kill me. It's peanut butter. Can you introduce yourself, please? I'm a YouTuber, blogger, entrepreneur. Carter Prankster 410. Subscribe. Around here, I'm known as Carter Dean. And I did not make Samantha Johnson slip on that skippy, okay? Who would use creamy peanut butter? Chunky is more practical. Carter Dean is always looking for pranks or fails to post on his YouTube channel. He exposes literally everyone. The video of me falling in peanut butter, it's gone viral. He planned for me to slip, I know it. He deserves to be expelled. You know, I could have died, you know? And for what? Content for his YouTube channel? Carter was definitely out to get me. I was not out to get her. Me and my boys just happened to be at the right place to get that nice school video. And guess what? I posted, everyone loved it. Okay, people love me. 10,000 subs, nobody can do what I do, okay? Within the next class change, word had gotten out. Everyone believed Carter had plotted against Samantha. It was student class president Kennedy Blake's job to settle everyone down and get all other videos deleted. Someone hit the ground <laughs> fast. Is that Carter's video? He just texted me. Dude, you text Carter? Gross. He sits next to me in chemistry. He was asking for the homework. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This already has 5,000 views. It was just a couple hours ago. How does he upload so fast? I don't know, Emma. You should ask him. Oh, shut me mouth. <laughs> I mean, poor Samantha and all, but this... It's so funny. Hey, 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 Carter just texted me and it's not about homework. Hey, Emma, it's Carter. The school said they're suspending me for making Samantha slip in the parking lot. <laughs> Apparently she got hurt real bad. I know rumors will start that I made her slip, but I didn't, I swear. Can you help me out? Sounds like you need more help than just chemistry homework. Oh my God. <laughs> hey guys, if you have any videos of Samantha, can you just delete them? You don't want to be the next Carter. <laughs> so it's official? He did this? I mean, they don't have any proof, but he's the one who posted the video, so it had to have been him. But Samantha's all over everybody's stories. Just because he posted the most popular video doesn't mean he did this. Emma, if you have a video, I need you to delete it. Carter has the most popular video. He'll take the fall for all of us. He's notorious for doing these types of things and ruining people's image. I just think we're all in agreement. <laughs> it's him. But he wouldn't intentionally hurt her. I don't think he did this. You know what? Maybe it was a right time, right place kind of a thing. Thank you so much, Kennedy. We will delete anything that we have. Thanks. I just want to protect the rest of the students. No one deserves to be humiliated like that. <laughs> Suspended, not expelled yet. I mean, the video was close to 30,000 views and they made me take it down? I was so close to greatness. And you know what the worst thing is? I showed the principal the picture of the cup. He didn't even believe me. The, the cup? Yeah. My boys went over to the crime scene, check it out, and they found this. All right? Now, it couldn't have been me, obviously, because all the girls drink from these cups. I'm not a girl, and I don't drink coffee. So it wasn't me. And remember everyone, our prices have taken a slip. Welcome ladies, everything is 15% off. What the hell is this? 
It's just a fun little joke. Have you seen the videos? We've all seen the videos, but can you explain this? You decorate these cups. Do you know who you could have sold that one to? I decorate these cups every morning. I don't remember. You'd have to ask half the girls in the school. Most girls buy coffee before school in the morning. So you're going to tell me that this cup could belong to, like, any female? Yep. And listen, most girls who buy coffee usually post about it right after to show their friends. I bet whoever took the first video of the slip is the one who did it, showing off their work. Courtney Glenn, varsity girls tennis player and a straight A student. The past three years, they have faced off in the science fair. With the fourth year coming up, Courtney wants to secure her win by taking out her competition. We are led to believe Courtney's video focused on the peanut butter in the parking lot. If so, why didn't she alert anyone about her findings? Because I wasn't even sure what it was. I was inspecting the substance. I couldn't have known if it was slippery enough to make a girl break her legs. Otherwise, I would have warned her. You were the first person to post a video of Samantha, so most people think it was you who had planned for her to fall. Never. Samantha may be my biggest competitor, but I would never do something like that. Besides, when she fell, I was the first person to help her up. What? She was sending me her full length video to see who else was there when it happened, but you saw what I saw. She only drinks Gatorade. Hey! You seen this? Everyone's reposting this. They all just want someone to blame. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. The school is ruining me. This could really end my channel. Like, my subs, everything. Dude, chill out. It is just a meme. Everyone will forget about it in like two days. You guys are trying to make me look innocent, right? Come on. Come on. Give me looking innocent. Hello, Carter Dean here. Once again, I did not cause the slip, okay? It wasn't me. And you know what? All these dumb peanut butter memes, it's not funny. It's hurtful, all right? I didn't mean for her to fall. Well, you usually post embarrassing videos of people, and now they post videos of you, so... Really? You're going to twist it like that? I mean, I'm out of school right now. This could ruin my college plans. And all because a girl fell and the video went viral. That's not my fault. I didn't mean for her to fall and get hurt. I didn't mean to. Mean to what, Emma? Nobody is on my side right now. Okay, nobody believes me. They all think I did it. This is meant to help you. We're gonna find out who did this. Bullshit, Emma. It's bullshit. You're not gonna find out who did this. All these interviews, it's just pointless. You're not helping me, you're not helping Samantha, and you're not even getting any closer to the truth, so what is the point? Students took to their social medias to share stories of their exploitation by Carter's videos. Suddenly, everyone was finding comfort in their embarrassing moments. Hating Carter's videos turned into a trend. It actually brought people together. No one was being laughed at anymore. People were seen as victims rather than funny characters in Carter's videos. Courtney just sent me her video. You have to see this. I don't think we should look into it anymore. Okay, but I think we have a new lead, though. Okay, I'm ready. And you know, if you're still interested in that coffee cup, I have a few girls in mind who might be out to get Samantha. That's okay. We aren't concerned with the other girls. We saw a video of you leaving the parking lot when Samantha was about to get out of her car. It looked a little sketchy. I know it looks bad, but I didn't do anything wrong, I promise. I was just helping a friend. I was walking to school when Kennedy Blake ran past me and into the bushes behind the parking lot. I thought it was just bad breakfast or something, but she was crying too. And then she just sprayed like everywhere. I asked her if it was food poisoning or if she needed to go to the nurse, but she said that she was just really nervous for a test. She told me she had extra clothes in the back of her car and asked me to go get them for her. I know she cares a lot about her reputation, so of course I said yes. I left her to vomit for a minute while I went to her car. 
On my way back, I saw the peanut butter and I thought it was weird, but it never occurred to me that it would hurt Samantha. When I got back to the bushes, Kennedy was gone. I guess she was just too embarrassed and left. If she put her cup down while Kennedy was puking, then it couldn't have been hers that was under the tire. Maybe someone else was there when Samantha fell. If it wasn't Maggie, then it could have been one of her friends. Even though her story matches the video, it's- Emma, you're spiraling. You're gonna drive yourself insane. I knew a person who uses peanut butter as a weapon could outsmart us. Hey! We have not been outsmarted. We haven't given up yet. Do you remember when we were little and we always went over to your grandma's house and she would let us read her old Nancy Drew books? We would read them and halfway through you would have already figured out who committed the crime. Everything just made sense to you. You figured all of those out. I'll figure this one out too. Well, I, I, I guess if I were Nancy, I would retrace my steps. We need to review the crime footage. Text Carter, ask him for the video. I will look at all of the accounts who reposted the peanut free meme because I have a feeling that it's gonna be one of them. I think Nancy heard us. I know this is about Carter. I heard about your little interviews. It's nice of you to include me in your Dateline special, but I don't really know how helpful I can be. I wasn't even there when it happened. But you know, Carter, you obviously have some strong feelings against him if you reposted that peanut free picture. I did repost that picture, but only because he hurt one of my fellow classmates. What was I supposed to do? He's been doing this since freshman year. He posts stuff for personal gain. Everyone knows he does it just for the clicks. Are you referring to this? What's up guys? Just got a brand new truck the other day. Drove it to school for the first time. It's pretty sweet. Let me show you how it is. A brand new Ram truck. It's pretty cool. Fresh kicks. Courtesy of my rich dad. He's such a good guy. I mean, I gotta thank him. Let me show you the exterior. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Did y'all see that? She fell right on her- Oh! <laughs> Is this a joke? Why would you show that to me? I thought I told him to delete that. It's embarrassing. You wanted to get back at Carter for posting that video of you. You were the one who planned for Samantha to slip. I didn't do anything. Carter's the one who posted that video and he should be punished. He always posts this kind of stuff and people let it slide because it's funny, but it's not. And I just never thought I was gonna hurt Samantha. I mean, I never thought he was gonna hurt Samantha. I don't want to talk anymore. Kennedy was suspended two days later. She had to step down from her position as student class president and got kicked off the soccer team. Carter came back to school and all of the boycott posts were deleted. Kennedy never bullied me. If anything, she was the only person who was popular and nice to me. I like to think I was just collateral damage, not actually targeted. But being the product of some base scheme will change your point of view on them. The weirdest thing is that she was always offering to help me around school when I was injured. The whole time she knew she was the one who caused it. Going back to school is hard. Uh, yeah, I mean all the people who reposted that dumb peanut butter meme, like they just stared at me. It hurts, kinda. I mean like, they were the ones viewing my video, laughing at it, and they just think I'm the monster. I've changed, okay? I stopped posting fail videos, prank videos, I mean... Kennedy got suspended, and I didn't even post a video saying uh, I got suspended for something I didn't do, even though that would have been clever. Me and my boys are cool. Yeah, we're still good. Everyone else at school, though, they kind of just tiptoe around me. I'm not vicious. I, I mean, I just made a mistake. I haven't heard from Samantha. I haven't talked to her. I did hear she's getting pretty fast on his crutches, though. Yeah. Kind of sucks, you know? I mean, everyone thinking the worst of you. Kennedy, she did something horrible. Everyone automatically just blames me. It's not right. I mean, they love my channel. Now look at it. Next time something terrible happens, will I be the one they blame?